An-225 Maria is the world's largest and most powerful transport aircraft. In 1988, the first flight of a prototype massive cargo plane created by the Kyiv Antonin Design Bureau took place. Maria in Ukrainian means dream. It was originally built for the needs of the space industry. In the early 2000s, it was reconstructed and modified for the transportation of super-heavy and oversized cargo. There was only one plane of the model An-225 in the world. It went down in history by setting about 250 world records for speed, height and carrying capacity. The wingspan of the An-225 Maria is 88.4 meters. The length is 84 meters. The height of the aircraft is 18.2 meters. And the carrying capacity is 250,000 kilograms. In March 1989, Maria took off with a load of 156.3 tons and set 110 world records for speed, altitude and payload in 3 hours and 45 minutes of flight. After the collapse of the USSR in 1991, the only functioning An-225 was sent to the HANA. In January 2002, Maria has yet again raced into the sky and made its first commercial flight. From that moment on, the aircraft was often used to deliver bulky cargo. Maria visited many countries on all continents except for Antarctica. On March 25, 2022, after 18 months of repairs, the modernization of the gigantic plane was completed. During the coronavirus pandemic, the aircraft has many times transported medicines, medical equipment and protective gear to different countries. For example, on April 27, 2022, An-225 delivered 10 million medical masks from China to Germany. And on August 24, 2021, on the 30th anniversary of the Independence Day of Ukraine, Maria participated in a parade flying over the center of Kyiv. As a result of an air attack by the Russian occupation troops on the airfield in Hostomel near Kyiv, at the beginning of a full-scale Russian invasion of Ukraine, the Ukrainian Maria aircraft burned down. On February the 27th, as a result of fighting in the city of Hostomel, our Maria aircraft was burned. Can we say that Russia destroyed our dream? No, it burnt the aircraft. It burnt iron, destroyed matter, but not the soul, not freedom, not dignity, not independence. We know that our dream cannot be defeated or destroyed. Recently, it was announced that Ukraine is preparing for the restoration and completion of the second An-225 Maria aircraft. This was stated by Yevhen Havrilov, Director General of the Antonov State Enterprise. He specified that it means the construction of the second Maria aircraft, which is already 30% ready. Reported by Pavel Steinmach, Yulia Bil, UATV News.